five weeks, I was having structure, um, lost fat while gaining muscle or building muscle, and have more energy. Nice. My favorite part of the challenge was um, just having, you know, that support, um, you know, just feeling good overall, and seeing, you know, progress, you know, outside of the scale. Um, that was probably the most important, and, and yeah, I'm Roberta Felipe. I'm a member here at CrossFit Jogunja. How long have you been here? I've been here since 2016 of November. Wow, five years. Yeah. Why did you sign up for the CrossFit Jungle Gym Nutrition Challenge? Uh, I signed up because I wanted some structure in terms of um, my eating habits. Um, I found that, you know, over the past year, especially during the pandemic, that um, I was going up and down with my nutrition, um, starting to feel, you know, not much energy. Um, also, you know, I just wasn't feeling good, wasn't feeling good and I wanted to change and, you know, I wanted to do something um, to get me back to it. Perfect. Tell us about your success over the last five weeks. Um, over the last five weeks, um, I've managed to get that energy back, um, get structure again in my eating. Um, I also gained uh, muscle and lost body fat, which I'm very happy. It's amazing. What was your first sign of progress? My first sign of progress, um, it was probably just, you know, noticing that, you know, I was enjoying eating, um, you know, vegetables and fruit again. Um, I was eating those in the past, but it wasn't n not the same amount. And, you know, I noticed what it can do to my body and especially the fact that when I would go work out, I, I noticed a difference um, in my energy throughout the day and also sleep. Good. That sort of leads me to my next question. What results did you get that you noticed that maybe weren't a part of the official measurements or something we wouldn't have seen? Um, hmm. I would say... Were you lifting heavier, hitting PRs? I would say, yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah, I was a lot stronger in the gym. I mean, there's a lot of things that, you know, some of the workouts where I noticed, you know, the, the, the strength was there. And um, also when I was up in the rings, I think last week, I was doing more than I even expected. And I haven't been in the rings in over a year, so it was very impressive. Wow, that's great. Yeah. What was the biggest obstacle we helped you overcome during the challenge? Uh, I think the biggest obstacle was just kind of, you know, in, in the way of, you know, having structure again, but also doing it in a, in a time where, um, like this month of May and even June with work, um, it's, it's very hectic and I had a lot of things going on. And the one thing I would say is just like, I was able to, you know, have the structure with the eating, which allowed me to structure my life in general. So. Um, that was probably the biggest, where I was able to manage all these things outside of work or in work, and yeah, it definitely played a factor. That's great. What were the top contributing factors to that success? Um, I would say the, the support, the support with the, the Facebook group, support with um, my family and, and, and my girlfriend as well. Um, they were very big in terms of, you know, being there and... and you know, there was, you know, it's, 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 it's the thing that we, we have to do ourselves, but also, you know, the having the support around you is very important. Yeah, the, um, the sense of community is really helpful. Exactly. Yeah. Is there anything you'd want to share with someone sitting at home in the same shoes you were in before you signed up? Um, I would say to anyone sitting at home, um, you know, I would say, you know, if, if you're looking for something to kind of get you back into whether, you know, either educate yourself in terms of you know, how, what is it that you should be doing in terms of feeling good in your body or, or losing uh, body fat percentage or, or even gaining, gaining muscle? Um, you know, doing the nutrition challenge is, is something that you should do in, in terms of, you know, being educated and having some structure because structure, I think, is important in life to have. And, you know, it, it's going to eventually balance out the other things that you have going on. And, you know, the, the better way, the best way to do it is just to jump into it. Um, I know I wasn't ready for it, um, and I knew I had a lot of stuff going on. And as you know, I'm the person sometimes that say, "Well, let me wait, let me wait." 
but sometimes you just have to go and do it and you know eventually you you know it won't be pretty in the beginning but you start learning you start learning and you start creating that habit and I think that's the most important thing and I say just do it yeah habits are so important so if you fill in the blank I am blank with my results I am <laughs> I am, I am happy, very happy and excited with my results. You had a great body com recomposition going yeah. on. If you read off the top results board, in five weeks I? In five weeks I was having structure, um, lost fat while gaining muscle or building muscle and have more energy. My favorite part of the challenge was? My favorite part of the challenge was um, just having, you know, that support um, you know, just feeling good overall and seeing, you know, progress, you know, outside of the scale. Um, that was probably the most important and, and yeah. Great work. You look awesome. Thank you. <laughs>